everybody. As you probably know, it's me, the Red Mage Crow. Man, we'd never actually gotten a nice close-up look at Surge, I don't feel. Anyways, welcome back to Chrono Cross, where, for all I know, this might be the last recording. Be the second last. Who knows? But it's time to use the time egg. Use it right here. Oh, no beginning and no end to the darkness of time. It's definitely time. This is the final gate with each. Ugh, what was that? So this is the final gate, which leads to the darkness of time. It is time to bring this chapter to an end and create a brighter future. Is that you, Draggy? I'm gonna fight to protect all the things I've come to love. Let's go. Wee woo. Wait. Are we going into battle? Wait. I'm sorry, what's going on? Wait, hold the phone, hold up. Wait, is this the fight? Is that Lavos? That's Time Devourer. I'm pretty sure that's Lavos. Um, pardon the intrusion. I mean, he's a lot smaller than Lavos, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I have no idea what the hell is going on. Omega Green. On to Draggy, how the hell dare you? Uh, what, what, uh, freaking thing did I put on to him? He has green field, so that means that Glenn has to start getting, like, his shenan shenanigans through. Dude, look at all this damage we're now dealing. Like, we are definitely in a very solid position. I say that, and yet I'm still very much terrified. Uh, you know what? I, I want to make sure that, like, I get the most out of this, so... Arrow Blaster. Another green. Okay, well, that's the case. He change element. No. But if that is definitely the case, we can just go and use heal all. We can save Greenfield for later, which will be very solid. Go right back to Glen. Get the elements we need. Use Genie to basically come out of the bottle and deal the damage we need. It's very weird, there's no music to this area. It's just the wind and whatnot. I would be lying if I said that it wasn't unsettling, because it's definitely unsettling. And, uh... It's also just very weird that... We're fighting whatever the hell this is. Am I right to, to think that this is weird? This is freaking weird. Oh, this is gonna hurt. I am somehow alive. Ooh, you think that uh, freaking heal all is going to heal the absolute living crud out of everyone? I think so. It didn't do much. I'm glad it did something. Come on. I'm gonna use the, uh, Sonja. I'm gonna use Sonja against it. This is gonna be the first time, if I can get a hit in. This is gonna be the first time where we use two of the... 
Uh, summons in a row. Not so much a row, but like one right after the other. I'm just gonna primarily use Glenn to do all the damage, I think. I don't know why this guy is a uh, white element. He's using a lot of green. This has to be weird, right? Like, I just feel it's weird. And he's using Omega Green, and it's not doing a lot of damage. I say that, but 300 damage is still 300 damage. I just want to get, like, uh, Glenn's level 5, level 6 off before I kind of, like, just start doing... No, anything else. Because that's going to <clears throat> maximize the damage with the field effect being at its strongest for him. If he can hit Glenn! God dang it! I hate that that actually hit Thunderstorm! Oh, this is gonna hurt. It didn't actually hurt. Okay. Well, I mean, oh, wait. Oh, frick. That's right. I'm supposed to. If this is the final battle, then this is where I would use the Chrono Cross, but this isn't the final battle, is it? And I don't even know, like... Simple fact that we're fighting the Time Devourer... ...really makes me feel like this should be the final battle. You know what? Two out of, uh... Two out of three is still going to be good damage. Screw it! Like, look at that. That's still good damage. Using Thunderstorm, that should hit a little bit harder now. Well, that hit hard, that's for sure. Now it's time for Glenn to use Redfield. If he could actually hit his moves, which would be very lovely if he... It seems that he is having quite the difficulty. Though Surge is definitely on point. Is it just cycling through a bunch of, uh... A bunch of the ele of the elements as I basically go down its HP. Is that is that what we're doing? That's probably what we're doing. Um heal all. Let's do it. Definitely use some heals. Now Glenn needs to I also wonder if that's like the colors for the song, you know? Is it green, yellow, blue? Little scared to try to attack, uh, to change the field. Uh, should I? Should I? Should I? I definitely could. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and... No! Oh, 
<laughs> oh no! That was unintentional. Oh, I'm so upset. Okay, well, time to go do that entire process over. I'll be right back, guys. Oh, what the heck? What happened? Hello? I did it? It didn't even transition to blue. Or is this a form change? Nope, it's dead. It's effing dead. Whatever the hell that was, it's dead. Okay, well. What? Oh, of the way, hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, hello, that didn't happen in the game. What the hell is going on? I'm sorry, um... Uh, I, I'm, I'm actually really baffled. I wasn't expecting that to be the, the final boss. Um... I was kind of expecting... More? Like... Uh, there has to be something more to the Chrono Cross that I need to do here. What the hell is going on? <laughs> I haven't been commentating. Um because I'm just I I'm so baffled. I was I was expecting so much more. I was expecting like I oh god. Okay, so I was expecting like, you know, a big big dungeon to go from point A to point B and you know, this and that, and, you know, shenanigans, right? Like, you, there's always a dungeon for the final boss. Might not be an actual dungeon, but it's typically... It's typically like, uh, something, you know, kind of similar. I also have no idea what's up with these real life segments. Um We're we're, we're definitely going to try and roll this back to like hopefully I uh, I'm definitely hoping that uh for whatever it is uh, this type of shenaniganry is, uh, is not going to, like, you know, automatically save an unchanging future. No. Yes. We're gonna... We're gonna- we're gonna roll that back. Okay, let's go ahead and, uh, let, let, let's get things kind of set up to where we can use Chrono Cross a Effectively. 
Okay, so now we... You're fine, but I need to... Need to do some jazz here. Okay, so I need uplift. Need uplift. Blaster? No, Bushwhacker and Gravity Blow. Gravity Blow, Bush Basher. Bushwhacker. Okay. And then for Raggy, Raggy needs a fireball. Aqua Beam. We don't have Aqua Beam. We're going to have to go find that. Or no, maybe somebody else has it equipped. Someone... Someone... Blue. Who do I know is... Um, that I... I'm pretty sure that... Um, what's her face? Okay, well, I'll figure that out. Um, and then he needs Photon Ray. I had to guess, Arnie Village. Look at that. Of everything I need to a degree. Back to Opasa. Get a uh, draggy somewhat ready with Aqua Beam. Now we are going to have to equip. Let's see. That's all. Okay, so now they have an improved stamina recovery rate. Just do that because it makes it somewhat easier. Um, and let's go ahead and save. And this should be everything that we need. Supposedly. Okay. 
The important thing, apparently, is to get Surge up to level 2 8 as soon as we possibly can. I say that, but he can't hit the broad side of a god dang car. Apparently no one can. Urge is the one that needs to go to uh, eight, but uh, I'm hoping that Glenn can heal us for not too much trouble, which it seems he can for the for a little bit. Okay. Now everyone defends. And now it's time. So first thing first, um, we use uplift. Then Draggy uses Fireball. Glenn uses a uh, bushwhacker. Raggy uses Aqua Beam. Now Surge just needs to one, two, three, one more. And now Glenn uses Gravity Blow. Raggy uses Photon Ray. And then we use Chrono Cross. And that theoretically ends the game. What the hell? <laughs> That, that looks like kid. It broke, but there was no sound effect. The music is so beautiful. What the hell is going on? What the hell is going on? I don't know. I'm so confused. Hold on, let's slow it down. This is important. Because theoretically, we shared the feelings of every single person alive, I guess, to this person. And this somehow defeats the giant monster, and... Everything's okay? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> That's going to be the title, I know it! I've been waiting an eternity 
Just for this very moment. Okay. Am I supposed to press something? Maybe I'm supposed to... Oh, I hope I don't skip this. Okay. Meaninglessly hurting one another. Disappearing life forms. Love to hate. Hate to love. Why are we born? Why do we die? Evolution? The survival of the fittest. What is there to be achieved from harming one another? Killing one another? The eggs that we call planets. And the innumerable spermatozoa. The life forms which gather around them. One of those countless seeds is joined with a planet. A new universe is born. All this exists for that one moment. Also that the universe can evolve into the next dimension. Does that make us all just pawns? For each of our short lives nothing but a cheap sacrifice just so the chosen life form can be born? No, that is not the case. Each and every one of us has a chance to become that one chosen life form. Yes, it could be you. Each of us tries to do our best with the hand we're dealt, be it our genes or the environment we live in. Each life form struggling to make the best of the life it's given forms a link in the golden chain that leads to the creation of a new universe. Every single thing in the whole world of nature is perhaps just dreaming a dream of life. All of them are also perhaps nothing more than a dream dreamt by a planet before its birth. Oh, but yes. Eventually all dreams will revert to Zervon. Sea of Dreams. God, you had me until you lost me! This was very nice, very poetic, and then you go say that. Surge, don't go yet, Surge. It's alright. Everything is alright now. Time which has been divided will be unified again now. The time for farewells has come. You will lose all memory of this whole adventure and return to your own time. This time, you will be able to live your own life. Yes, we'll continue to follow in my brother's footsteps as a great dragoon. Good luck to you, Serge. Look forward to the next time we meet. Thanks, Serge. We'll always be friends, right? Always. We alone do not have the power to heal the world's woes or to solve all of its mysteries. And yet, even then, it was a bloody good knowing you, mate. Thank you. For being born, you fudge. Guess now's the time to say you later, mate. But I'll find you sometime, somewhere. I'm bloody sure of it. So, wait, is the princess kid? Is that what I'm supposed to be like connecting the dots to? No, I don't think so. No matter the time, no matter the world you live in, I'll find you. I'm sure. I'm sure I will find you. Oh dear god, I feel like that's a threat at this point. Oh? Surge. Are we going back to the point in which I died? Surge! Hey, Surge! Oh. 
Hey, Lena! Huh? What? Who? You alright? What's the matter? Hm. I don't know. Can't seem to remember. Don't scare me like that. You just passed out all of a sudden. Hm? What? Eric Tower? I thought I wasn't supposed to remember any of this! God dang voice lied to me! What are you talking about? You just got here. You got some Komodo dragon skills for me. Don't you remember? Oh. You sound confused. Come on, Serge. Get with the program. How do you know what a program is? Hold up, wait, that's an inconsistency. Our summer's only just started. It's like nothing happened at all. Am I the only person who kind of don't like endings like that? Thus the curtain closes on another tale. Eternity has passed. Fleeting dreams fade into the distance. All that is left now is me and my memory. Like, I, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I just don't like it when, like, an adventure happens and then it never happened. You know? It's, I don't know. I'm sure we'll meet again. Someday you and I. Another place, another time. That we might not realize that you and I are me. Let us open the door to the great unknown. Across another reality. Live another day today. Even when the story has been told, life goes on. Till we meet again. Take care of yourself, my friend. Forever yours. Shala Kidzeal. So wait, yeah, Shala. Shala is the uh, princess, if I recall. So, Kid is Shala. But wait, wouldn't that mean that this is like an entire paradox or something? Is Kid a Paradox? Um, am I supposed to do something? Pressing X. Oh, okay, there we go. Okay, and it's this again. All right, okay, mmm. Mmm! Okay, so, okay, 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 okay. So I... I'm gonna give my rating now. Cause that's what I do at the end of every single game. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the music out of my ears. Uh. Now, this game is definitely a game that I remember playing as a child, and I know that I really liked it back then. I liked it to this point, too. Sure, like, my memory kind of failed me at one point. Pretty badly, I might add. Um, however, uh, you know... The point being is that this game has very deep t ties to nostalgia and because I think it has those ties, even though I didn't get past like the very beginning and whatnot, I do think I am going to be a little bit more critical on this game, right? And basically, I want to say I'm going to give this game a good old... Okay, part of me wants to say 6.5 out of 10. But I think I am going to be just a tad bit lenient. A tad bit, take it as you will. A 7 out of 10. Now, the thing is that the battle system is very nice the story i feel is kind of out there 
they do need you to at least to like fully kind of understand a majority of what's going on you kind of need to know a little bit of trigger which is fine you know that's that's fine and i do plan to play trigger and whatnot this is supposed to be kid i think that's what this is trying to say that this is supposed to be kid uh anyways and I i'm fine with that like you don't necessarily need to know anything from trigger to enjoy this game um it would definitely help um i do think that you know the thing that for me personally brings this game down i don't know i think that i'm just one of those people who are like we need exp in order for you to be kind of willing to go the extra mile because i i flat out i ignored like a bunch of fights and sure there was this one point where i was like oh yeah i need to grind up i didn't end up doing that and i was able to beat the game quite easily so long as i had draggy and glenn with me so i didn't need any of that but like all together like i don't know i just like seeing numbers go up so the exp is definitely like the thing that kind of like brings it down as well as the ending uh primarily being like oh <laughs> yeah it's a it's a time thing uh we went on this mission but uh none of it actually happened so uh the adventure never happened and it's like to, to, to me that's like that that's kind of a cop out i feel i don't know maybe it's not a cop out but like i i just don't like it when stories do that it's me personally um is it a game you should play yeah you know there's like over what 40 50 characters and whatnot and you know you can always find someone you like i freaking love draggy and i love glenn there are people who are going to definitely like kid i personally don't like kid <laughs> that's my hot take um i i personally don't like kid uh she just kind of seemed to force surge into like you know this situation that he primarily did not want nor need to be in. I don't know. She did save him. And whatnot. Mind you. And if I have to search the world over. Sometime, somewhere. Sure. Could Serge have gotten home by himself? Debatably. Maybe. Oh, hey! I sound like a seagull there, like... <laughs> also like another thing that i really did not particularly like was the whole kind of it seems to forcefully tell you that like kid and surge are definitely like kind of destined to be together i don't <laughs> that's one ship i will not die on I do like Harley and Surge, I really do, but like a part of me is like, eh, it really should be like probably Lena and Surge, but I freaking really like Harley. Let me have this, please! <laughs> oh, but yeah, that's, that's it. I've been wanting to play this game for years and actually beat it, and here I am it's done it's kaput it's holy jeez and i'm not looking forward to the next series but thank you all so very much for watching i hope you all enjoyed and go ahead you know it's gonna be the question of the day did you guys enjoy this game go ahead Tell me your favorite bits and pieces. And if you didn't enjoy it, you can also tell me what you didn't like about the game personally. Because, like, I, I liked a lot of it. I liked a lot of the characters and whatnot. But, uh, ultimately, uh, two of my biggest gripes were primarily that. 
um you know and the story kind of like also was kind of uh you know what's going on <sighs> other than that it's fine but thank you one more time for watching and i'll see you all oh dear god in resident evil 4 this time i promise i'm not going <laughs> to can like diverge into another Digimon game. I'm sorry. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.